Northern California. Great day on the water. 80 boats out here, guys. And I'll tell you what, this team took it on. Three places, three places. That's third in some people's language. Three if you're just like real tired like I am. I'll tell you what. And this guy catches the 847, which tied for big fish. Then we flipped the coin and he lost a trophy today. But we'll make it right by him. Don't worry about that. So I'll tell you what. How did you catch your fish, guys? Tell me how you guys caught. How many pounds you guys had? 22 something? Uh, yeah, 22.57, I think. And how did you guys catch your fish? Uh, you know what? We fished really, really fast. We covered pretty much all of the north. And uh, we were throwing, I was throwing a frog, and he was backing it up either punching or uh, throwing a sinko. So, how many frog fish did you catch? Um, I'd say actual frog fish that got in the boat, probably around 10 to 15. Well, I gotta ask because you just opened up that can. You got a lot of blow ups? A lot of blow ups, but uh, you know what? Uh, having uh, Matt in the back of the boat uh, throwing a sinko, uh, a lot of those boats found their way, in, or a lot of those fish found their way inside the boat. Outstanding. Now, when you told the crowd out here how you and what you were looking for, I want the viewers to find out what you were fishing clear like and what was you looking for for the, the type of structure for that frog bite. Uh, you know what? I actually, uh, two weeks ago at the right, or at the California Delta, I kind of figured out we somehow it worked here too, but the penny warp mats that didn't have not totally or bloomed yet were, uh, were really easy to work a frog through and you didn't have to punch him or anything so we ran around you know we, we fished tulies and stuff but when when we got to those the penny wart mats uh, you you could almost count on a bite nice nice now you're the big backup you're like the backup you know I'm his backup so you backed up several big fish with that you know weightless worm throwing that weightless worm out there and you caught that 847 to, to, to tie for uh, the place how many fish did you think you caught on the backup oh, on the backup uh, you know probably three or four not not a whole lot but it, you know a lot of times they, they hit that frog and then they're spooked and they're gone uh, you know especially if you know he's yanking the hook on him uh, so you know I, I was happy to get those three or four and obviously it was one of the ones that mattered so I tell you what it's all about teamwork and they made it very clear that backup didn't matter who caught the bigger fish because if I was him, I'd be kicking me in the water, man. That's what I would have done. But hey, they made it very clear. It didn't matter who caught them. It's a matter they caught them. It's a team event. And that's what it's all about. Here at the BBT Tournament on Clear Lake, California. Congratulations, guys, for your third place win.